Andrew McCart, IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. Delighted to be joined by, listen, Tyson Fury said good things about you, Jared Anderson. Jared, uh, listen, you've got a, a tough opponent, a tough rushing ahead of you. Um, what's your thoughts on the fight? Um, just to be sharp, you know, uh, keep my composure uh, and break him down. He said that he was ready for it, there's going to be a war and stuff like that. Now, you've, you've got that style that everyone enjoys. You're, you're a heavyweight, but you're not the biggest heavyweight. So you've got more head movement, you're slick and stuff like that. But you can stand and trade. Will there be elements of this fight where you're going to have to bite down on that gum shield and just trade leather with this guy? Uh, that's the, the fun of the sport for me. So I believe I definitely think there's going to be um, points where I'm going to pick and choose. You know, I'm going to make sure that I got him on his back foot or maybe he's working on his defense at this time because uh, he sees a lot of punches but when I trade. But, you know, I'm going to make it uh, a mental thing and I'm going to make him have to think about it. I mean, you are only 22 years old. You're still you're still a baby in this game, especially in the head. To 21 technically, well, 22, uh, uh, Christina said, but 20, 21 technically, you're, you're still a baby in this sport. And to be a heavyweight as well, man, there's, there's a lot of learning to go. So are you still learning your game? Are you still learning this craft? I'm still learning. I'm still growing um, mentally, physically. I just grew another half inch since uh, last time they checked my reach. So um, I'm still growing all around the board, but I'm moving fast and I'm growing fast. Talk to me about this, uh, this card. I mean, what a card. It's heavyweight stacked. It's heavyweights everywhere. Future opponents, maybe for you at some stage in your career. I mean, what, what, what does it mean to you to fight on a huge, huge undercard, a huge main event like Tyson Fury and Wilder here in Las Vegas? It's a huge opportunity. I'm thankful um, for my promotional company, my manager, and everybody putting this together. Um, and happy to just be able to show my skill set. You know what I'm saying? So uh, I love the hype and everything, but I'm just here to do what I love. Talking about hype, Tyson Fury, and I spoke to Shane Fury as well, his, his brother, Tyson's brother. Both of them said to me that when Tyson leaves this game, you're the next big heavyweight coming through. You're the next star. You're going to take over Tyson Fury. You're going to take over Lennox Lewis, Mike Tyson. You're going to be the next one. When you hear this coming from Tyson Fury, who's been there, done it, and done it all, what does that mean for you? Do you feel pressure? Not at all. I think they're a little biased, um, you know what I'm saying, being our relationship and all. But um, I'm just happy uh, that they believe that, but I'm going to show it. You know what I'm saying? That's what, that's what matters, me showing it, not just what they say um, with their words, but me with my actions. So that's what I'm looking forward to. Talking about actions, you have sparred Tyson Fury. Now, Tyson back home, he doesn't spar with head guards. He, he, he sort of toys with his opponent and stuff like that. How did you do in the spars? Um, I believe I held my own, uh, being that you know he's giving me a lot of praise and all. Um, but we'll leave that to practice. Uh, we just gonna show what we did, um, and that sparring we gonna show it in the ring this Saturday. Talked about the main event then. Who wins? Tyson Fury versus Wilder. I mean, he's obviously got Tyson's got you into the camp to, to obviously mimic some of that style. But you are a different style than Wilder. Can can you put a, can you pick a winner here in Vegas? Uh, I, you know I'm biased, as I told everybody else. Um, I believe seventh round. Don't go no further, Tyson. What can fans expect from you on, on Saturday night then? I mean, the knockout king, you're, you're known for knockouts now and stuff like that, but what can we expect from you come Saturday? We expect sharpness um, and expect a breakdown. You know, we're going to break him down and we're going to get our win how we get our win. If it comes by knockout, it comes by knockout, but we're here to win. He's undefeated, man, so it's going to be, he's going he's, he's gonna to come to win. He's a live opponent, isn't he? Yes, he's definitely a live opponent, but I'm an even liver opponent, so they'll see. Definitely. Well, Jad, pleasure meeting you, my man, and good luck this Saturday. Thank you, thank you.